Hey everybody, welcome back to Valida's World, where as you can see, I'm down in the eBay room. I call it the eBay room, but it's really um, the where I call it, it's the eBay room slash warehouse because I sell on more than just eBay, as you all know. So I said, let me chat with you guys. I got quite a few sales this weekend, um, but before we get into the uh, what all sold and everything, I just want you all to know uh, Memorial Day weekend was fabulous. Today is Monday. Oh, today is Memorial Day. Post office ain't open today. Why am I thinking I'm getting ready to go to the post office and it's Memorial Day and it's closed? <laughs> I do this every time on a holiday. I'm thinking I have to ship out everything today because it's a Monday and it's Memorial Day. So I don't have to ship out nothing till tomorrow, Tuesday. Thank you, Jesus. All right, so now I ain't got to worry about rushing and trying to get this stuff together. But I'm going to start um, packaging up some of these packages because so far I am up to, I think, seven or eight sales over the weekend, which is pretty good for me. The most I've ever sold in a weekend is 12 items. Um, but like I said, I want to talk to you all about my gastric bypass and um, what I did this weekend. As you can see, I show, I'm show i going to show you guys, it was storming this morning. I mean, thunder and lightning. The dogs refused to go outside. Lord, I know their legs is crossed. They haven't used it in the house. Thank you, Jesus. I keep trying to take them outside, but it's, it's just raining so hard. They won't go, and you can't make them go outside when it's raining this hard. Um, so this weekend, I did not go over anybody's house. I did not eat um, anything that was really bad, uh, this weekend, I pretty much tried to stick to my low card. Um, as you've seen from my last vlog, I'm da I was down three pounds, um, this week, weigh in, uh, the grandkids are still here because mom and dad and my son and his wife, they went out, um, to, uh, a concert yesterday. And um, so I kept the kids all, well, Riley been here since he got out of school and KK came and they dropped KK off as well. So they've been with me all weekend and I was doing Nana duties, you know, watching TV with them. And I wanted to give them as much time um, as I can and sit and fix them breakfast and some quick dinners. So yesterday, <laughs> Uh, while everybody was eating barbecue and everything, I was exhausted. And I said, guys, I'm a, I know I'm always tired, but I push myself. I just keep going and keep going and keep going. So I said, um, what y'all want to eat? I'm going to take y'all to grab you a bite to eat. And uh, KK was like, well, Nana, I don't really want to go to a restaurant because me and mom went out the other day and ate. And I said, oh, no, I was going to do a drive through I'm not getting dressed. So I'm just like a burger, tacos, or whatever. You know, we can do a drive through and, and you guys can get some because I didn't want to cook. So KK goes, Riley, well, Riley can choose. So she let her little brother choose where to go. So he chose McDonald's. And guess what? I didn't get their French fries. I didn't get their burgers. I did not get one thing from McDonald's. I did the drive-through, got the kids what they wanted, and came right on back home. And I went in the refrigerator, um, as you've seen from um, Sunday's vlog. If you didn't, I'll add it somewhere up here where you can just click on it. Or you can just go into uh, subscribe to my channel and go into videos and click on it. I don't know how to attach a video in the link but I can attach it up somewhere up at the top. So I'll attach it somewhere up at the top and you can click and you can see where I cook um, these uh, low carb, I mean high protein uh, pasta noodles. And for the high protein pasta noodles, you get, I think it's one third cup is 24 grams of protein. And at first when I was eating them, I didn't like it. Well, it's not the protein uh, pasta that tastes bad. What tastes bad 
is the Italian sausage that I put in it that I had left. I had bought it at a, bought these sausages uh, in a meat order that we got um, last year and I don't like for my meat to sit too long. So um, I was cooking it up. Uh, I don't like those. Out of all the meat that we got from that meat order, those Italian sausages was horrible. I mean, horrible. So that it made my pasta uh, not taste good. So that's what it was. It wasn't so much as the pasta was bad. It's the, um, it's the, it's the, it was the meat. The pasta is uh, a little dense. You got to cook it a long time for it to cook right. I'm not going to tell you it's the best pasta in the world. But is it tolerable? Yes. Could I, would I buy it again? At first I was saying no, but yeah, I would, especially for the protein. And um, with the bell peppers in there my that I had in there and my rail sauce, it was pretty good. I didn't add no extra salt or pepper to it. And maybe if I had to add some more salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder to it, it would have even bumped it up even more with flavor. But it was very flavorful. It's the sausage that I didn't like. So um, that's what I had was the protein pasta. Um, I In the last vlog, I think I showed you what it was. It was called, it's by Pastabilities. It's the maker of it, Pastabilities. And they make all type. They make low carb pasta, high protein pasta, you know, the different uh, healthy pastas for you. My grandson is up there making all kind of noise and I'm going to get him. He know I'm down here vlogging. All right, guys. So um, let me let you go for a minute, and I'm going to try and start pulling some of this information. I'm going to go up here and get on this boy for making all this noise because I'm not going to have this. All this bumping. All right, I'll be back. Eight something in the morning. I brought the dogs out. They ain't going out. Bentley turned around and took off running back in the house. When it rains, they won't go in the backyard. So we have to let them out in front. Ooh, you see that thunder? That lightning? Yeah. Yeah, they ain't going to potty. I can hang that up. Okay, you guys. So this is my sales. I use this system called Bendu and it makes it easier. So I sold um, this crop shirt on Poshmark and these khaki pants, Chino on Macari, a shirt on eBay, North Face pants on Poshmark, a skirt on uh, Depop, a dress on eBay, a jean jacket on Macari, a Dymo portable propane heater on um, Poshmark, green envelope woman's v-neck dress on ebay and for 60 dollars this juicy couture uh cross body bag university cross body bag which is very popular i sold that on macari so um this is what it's looking like far as my sales go um i have all these items here on macari and it says sold right here for the uh, crossbody bag. I sold that for $60. Now this was a return item I sold to a woman and she didn't like it, uh, uh, new with tags, denim jean jacket, and she sent it back. Mind you, I sold it to her for $16. And this time I got full asking of $29. I had this handbag, it's stained on the inside and I let them know it was really stained and I showed all the flaws on this bag. Even with all the flaws, it sold for $60. I had it for $120 because it's so popular. Now, these American Eagle uh, shorts, um, I got these at the bins, if I'm not mistaken. I only paid $1, I think, for those um, jeans. I'm going to go over here and look. This is how I used to keep track of uh, all my items back in the day. 
Um, so I have to go over here. Th anything over here, like this stuff was listed way back in April, 2023. So I'll look in here and see uh, when those American Eagle jeans were uh, listed. Um, nine times, and, and it, it's in, it was in 074 was the unit number. So I would look and see if I can find 074 and I can determine how long, but I think those were over a year. 078 is what it is. Um, they've been sitting probably about a year. Here it is right here. American Eagle shorts. So I'll put, um, so 05, uh, 26 slash uh, 24. And they've been listed since, um, not quite a year since August 7th of 2023. I'll show you that. See, August seventh, twenty twenty three. So that's how long they was they were sitting, and I paid, like I said, one dollar. I paid one dollar for them, and um, I sold them for six. So I got my money back because all the money comes to me on Macari. So I made five dollar profit on that. I made $29 profit on the jacket and I made six, uh, uh, well, not 29 minus the, my fees. This was $5. So I made a $55 profit on the, on the, um, purse. Now, next I had some sales over here. New with tags, Victoria's Secrets, camel sweater. Now I bought this sweater, um, at, uh, where was it? Plato's Closet. I paid $3 for it. I paid $3 for it. I had it listed for $25. It's been listed since um, January uh, 4th. And um, I sold it for $13. Um, that's me not knowing how to price my items really well, but that's okay. I didn't know Victoria's Secret certain item sale. I thought because it had the logo and it's a crop camo sweatshirt, size large, I thought it would have done better. But $3 into $10 minus Poshmark fees, I'm probably making a profit of about $8. And then here's the North Face joggers, drawstring waist. Now I bought those, I think for $2. I bought those at a yard sale. I'm pretty sure I bought those at a yard sale. Uh, nope, I got those at um, Goodwill Bins. I paid $1.75 for them. I had them listed for $24. Okay, so, um, and they sold on Poshmark for $15. $10 less than what I listed them for. I ain't got a problem with it. Minus the Poshmark fees and... Um, which is going to be probably $2 and, uh, along with, um, my dollar. So I probably spent $4 and made an $11 profit. This dyno, uh, pour, pour heater, I paid $8 for it, sold it for $20. So I'm probably going to walk away with about a, a $14 profit there. So I had three sales on Poshmark. I got three sales on eBay, three sales on Macari, so and one sale. So I made uh, ten sales um, so far, and the weekend, the holiday weekend, isn't over yet. Hopefully, I'll make some sales today. Um, this uh, Life Is Good T-shirt sold for nine dollars. And, um, I got this at, um, the bins. It was a dollar 84.
It was $1.84. I got it at the bins. Um, I got this dress for free. So this is all profit. Uh, remember the yard sale I did, you guys? Um, I did that yard sale last week. I sold it for $15. So that's all profit. The young lady gave it to me. Um, this right here, this green envelope, I thought I bought her at the Goodwill here in Douglasville. Uh, I'll know when I open it up. Yep, I paid 99 cents for it. So that's profit all day long. I paid 99 cents for that dress, new with tags. And that's why I bought it. It was 99 cent new with tags. Um, and it was just a regular old ship shirt dress. And it sold for $9.75 because I ran a sale. This was sold with 25% promotion. So it was promoted. So I got to pay promoted fees with that one. And um, you guys also remember... Uh, the propane portable heater, y'all remember I got that at the yard sale as well. So two things I got at the yard sale last uh, week, Saturday before last, have uh, sold. And I just listed them uh, this week. The dress that was given to me and the heater, I just listed it and it sold. So let me get to packing the, these orders up. Um, although I don't have to ship them off till tomorrow. And um, I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, guys, so this is all my packages. There's quite a few here. I've never had such a cute little pile. Look at that. All those sales. So now I'm going to take some pictures and list some more because I need to get some more sales. Hopefully I'll get some more before um, today is over to add to the collection. That heater... If I profited anything on there, it was 3 or $4 because I had to pay extra shipping because it sold on Poshmark. And Poshmark only allows up to five pounds. After that, it come out of your money. I hate it sold on Poshmark. I wish it had it sold on another platform. Next time, I won't put anything on Poshmark that's over um, five pounds. But it's a lesson learned. Well, look like I have to do a store run. My son and them, they're having a little something at their house today. So I asked them if they want me to bring something, and they said yeah. So I'm going to run into the store right quick and grab a few items for them. I wasn't planning on doing nothing this weekend, just staying in the house. <laughs> but this is... Um, since I've been out here, this is the first time that I'm going to their house for anything, so I gotta go. Run in the Publix. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay. Mm -hmm. watermelon look good but i'm allergic to it i wind up in the hospital i'm probably the only black person that's allergic to watermelon she wanted a, a cake she said cake dinner rolls and forks and spoons so that's what i gotta do Get a cake, dinner rolls, and forks and spoons. Hmm. She didn't say what kind of cake she wanted. She just wanted a cake. Oh, goodness.
mixed berry cheesecake. I think I'm gonna get that. Yeah, the mixed berry cheesecake. I know everybody likes cheesecake, so I'll get that. My daughter and I don't eat chocolate cake. And I didn't want to get a. I didn't want to get a red velvet because that's chocolate, made with chocolate. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what comes on Okay, guys, this is Georgia crazy ass weather. Now, I showed you guys this morning with the dogs not being able to go out because of the storm and thunder and lightning. Now it's hot. It's, <laughs> the sun is out. It's beautiful. Just crazy the way the days turn out. All right, let me get on in my son's house. Thanks for watching, you guys. If this is your first time, please hit that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell button so you can be notified every time I op upload a new video. And if you're returning, as always, thank you so much for your support and patience. And remember, guys, peace, love, and happiness is the only way to live. Now, don't forget, hit the bell button, and I'll see you in the next video. By the way, this picture was taken from my daughter and son's, uh, my daughter-in-law and son's front porch of the sky. I thought it was gorgeous and decided um, to share it with you all. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. I will be uploading another one on Wednesday. These vlogs are a little behind because I vlog for the whole week and then I upload. Thank you.